Okay, so I'll see you, Nipple, at Milan. Augie, <laughs> she's crazy. I mean, they're all crazy. They're living in a different world. I mean, there's all this incredible food here. No one has even touched it. I mean, on my planet, this table would look like it was attacked by wild dogs. Short, fat, Jewish wild dogs. How refreshing. I've never seen anyone eat at one of these things. Oh, man. I thought you were David Bowie. Close. Hugo Chapman. Andy Marshak. Andy. <laughs> Have you met Hugo? Hugo is the editor of The Magazine. You know the one I'm writing for? Are you? Because it feels like you've been avoiding me. <laughs> I haven't been avoiding you. And is my new, my new... Uh, assistant. <laughs> so has she been working on the piece? Uh-huh. <laughs> because, Milan, you know, the deadline's almost here, and I don't know a thing about what you're writing. This should be good. Roma. <laughs> Where'd you find the Hobbit? Roma, oh, this is... Uh... So, Milan, darling, what is this uh, piece going to be about? Well, this party. Oh, so it's basically just the list of who's here? Well, it's much more than that. <laughs> <laughs> because any model can make that list? I just want to know what you have to say that anyone is going to care about. Just tease us with the headline. Yes. Tease us? Well, <laughs> um, um, life at six feet. It's uh, it's about how much better life is for beautiful people. Better. How is life better for us beautiful people? <laughs> That's true. Life is better for beautiful people, but they never want to admit it. You're on to something, Milan. This really jazzes me. I'm really jazzed about this. Can hardly wait. Skip no, your